Daniel Cormier, even Lance Armstrong is weighing in on dirtbag John Jones. Two-weight UFC champion Daniel Cormier has expressed his disbelief at John Jones' latest drug testing situation, claiming it is so unbelievable that even Lance Armstrong is weighing in. Jones makes his highly controversial comeback this weekend at UFC 232 against Sweden's Alexander Gustafsson, following on from his 15-month suspension after testing positive for Torin Abel after his victory over Cormier himself. This weekend's event was initially set for Las Vegas, but Jones has been found with a trace of Torin Abel in his system again, meaning Nevada will not sanction the fight, but California will, so the entire card has been shifted. LA Gunnar Solskjaer fires warning to Romelu Lukaku and Alexis Sanchez what Paul Pogba told Man United's players in first Old Trafford game after Moreno sacking Massimiliano Allegri ready to accept Manchester United job offer however, UFC executive Jeff Nowitzki has defended Jones while also stating on the JREMMA podcast that it would be categorically unfair to not allow him to fight Gustafsson. This has provoked both Cormier and shamed cyclist Armstrong to voice their strong opinions on social media, with the former branding Jones a dirtbag cheater. This guy John Jones is such a dirtbag cheater that even Lance Armstrong is weighing in law. Lance is like where the fuck was Jeff when I was going through this shit law. And boy how did Jones turn Jeff Nowitzki into his old lady. This is the craziest shit I've ever seen. And now people sending me clips of this dude being arrogant at a press conference. That is one crazy negro. Jeff Nowitzki Jones lol mal hash use at a fake hash Torin Abelay post shared by Daniel DC Cormier, at DC underscore man, on December 27, 2018 at 3.29 pm PST when is UFC 232? UK time, fight card. TV channel and odds for Jones vs Gustafsson 2 Conor McGregor's teammate reveals truth about UFC star potentially losing his coach Ally Akrinti demands Conor McGregor fight, he must fight me to get a rematch with Khabib. Armstrong has history with UFC's Novitsky as he was a major player and the cyclist being stripped of his seven Tour de France titles. At the time, Novitsky was in his former role with the US Food and Drug Administration. Couple of questions, Armstrong commented on Joe Rogan's Instagram post announcing Novitsky's podcast appearance. Why the double standard for Jones and others? And let's get right to it, what does the science and scientist say? I think I know the answer, but let's let the star effer speak to it. Cormier also lost against Jones back in January 2015 as well as in July 2017. The 2015 result still stands as a victory for Jones as he did not fail a drugs test at the time. More, when is UFC 232? UK time, fight card, TV channel and odds for Jones vs Gustafsson 2.